Hey guys, what is up? This is the Middleman here with Guides for Us All, and today I'm going to be showing you how to get the unique weapon Nephi's Golf Driver in Fallout New Vegas. So you don't need to get this quest to get the weapon, but I recommend going to Camp McCarran and having a little chat with Major Daughtry, and he will give you a quest called the Three Card Bounty, and when he asks you who you want to hunt, you want to hunt Driver Nephi. So once you get to the location, you're going to have to kill Driver Nephi. There's no other way to obtain this weapon. So pop a cap in Driver Nephi's head. You can use vats to make it more dramatic, just like I did. Head pops off, flies off onto the ground and uh, go to his body and pick up the weapon. It's the only way to obtain it. You can't pickpocket it off him. You can't sneak up and do anything else. There's no conversational aspects of getting this weapon. So, Nephi's Golf Driver is a unique golf club utilized as a two-handed weapon. Compared to its more common variant, the 9-iron, it is in more pristine condition and appears to be straight, not old and battered. It has a special 4 attack that, re that does regular damage to vats, but at the cost of 4 more action points will always knock down enemies. That's pretty awesome, actually. Always knocks down enemies. So it's possible to execute that special attack outside of vats, uh, without the required melee skill of 50 by initiating a power attack. Basically, you hold the attack button while moving forward. Nephi's Golf Driver can successfully strike about 245 times from full condition before breaking, and it can only be obtained by killing Driver Nephi, like I said. Some notes about the weapon. While in third person, the driver makes the sound of hitting a golf ball while doing a charge attack. I did not know about that. The model for this weapon is a driver rather than a 9-iron, despite the game treating it as a unique variant of the latter. It will disappear from Nephi's inventory if you don't pick it up within three in-game days of killing him. If you look at the club in third person, there's an ace of spades engraved on the head of the weapon. It is also visible in first person if you look up enough. This weapon can be used to get the Gunrunner's Arsenal Challenge, a slave obeys, which I think is for killing Mr. House with the 9-iron, or with Nephi's golf driver. And the image on the Pip-Boy for this weapon differs from the image for a 9-iron, so very interesting. It doesn't actually look like its standard variants, which doesn't happen often. Usually they look just like them, but with a few little changes. This is actually a completely different uh, skin for it. It's a golf driver as opposed to a 9-iron. Anyways, this weapon isn't all that interesting, just a few weird things about it. I really want to know what that sounds like when you the sound of hitting a golf club when you charge attack them in third person. I never knew about that. I don't usually play in third person, so I probably wouldn't have figured that out on my own. Anyways, thank you guys very much for watching the video. If you could, please leave a like rating down below and subscribe to see some more videos in the future. I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.